Vardhan Kapoor, welcome to E-Times and Film Fair OTT Awards 2022. Thank you so much for uh, talking to me and very happy to be here. Tell us about your look. So this is a suit from my personal uh, collection. Uh, this is a suit by a Los Angeles based designer called Mike Amiri. So it, uh, Amiri is a Los Angeles based label that started in 2014 and it really kind of is about um, rock and roll and rebellion and kind of being rebellious but also um, it's the best materials in the world, it's very finely tailored and the idea it's, is that it's, it's luxury wear for people with a little bit of an edge and an independent spirit and so I feel like the brand really works well for me. Um, it's also mainly really cut for, for taller, slimmer men uh, and so I think that it kind of works for, for my frame. So I, I, love, I love it and I'm, I'm wearing a, a suit by my comedian, those are also shoes by him. So. Now it's no news that you're a sneaker head. Has right. your collection gone up a little bit? So what I'm, I'm always kind of uh, looking for the next thing, you know, I think it's kind of, uh, oh there he is, it's kind of an addiction uh, in a way and so you're always kind of looking for the next thing, what is the next thing and I, what I also do is like if I really feel like I'm not going to wear something then I get rid of it. I either give it to somebody or I sell it and then I, that allows me to kind of buy more, you know. So it's a, I'm always looking for a piece of clothing that inspires me or a pair of shoes or a watch. Uh, or a pair of sunglasses. So I'm a collector. I collect music, I collect films, I collect clothes, I collect shoes. Harsh, what's your take, you know, when it comes to actors picking, you know, for a film particularly, whether it's OTT or theatrical, what is your thought process like? Do you feel like the lines are still blurring or it's still at a plateau stage right now? I think everybody has different things they want from life in the moment. So I started with two very experimental films, but they were for theatres because there was no OTT back then. Mirzia, uh, Rakesh Om Prakash, Mehra, Bhavesh, Joshi, Vikram, Dutte, Motwani. Then I realized after Bhavesh didn't do well in cinemas, but became a really big thing on OTT. Uh, I was like, you know, you're not going to, I don't want to compromise on the, the quality of work that I do. Uh, but I also want to kind of keep working. And if a film comes to me where it's, it's probably better suited for a digital kind of situation, then I would do it. And then I did uh, Ray with Vasan Bala, who now did Monica, oh my darling, and I did uh, AK vs AK with Vikram Aditya Motwani, small part, and that night produced and acted in Thar, which took five years to make. We wanted to do it for the cinemas initially, but then we got a really good deal for OTT. But even though Thar is for OTT, we didn't compromise on the visual spectacle of the film. If you see the film, it looks like it's, in, it's a technical marvel. And the idea is to give people a cinematic experience, you know, even if they, they have a small screen. And um, I'm curious, you know, I, I don't know, maybe Thar would have done well in theatres because people would have wanted to see that world uh, of the Western, Rajasthan, the, it's never been shot like that. So I'm happy that it's, uh, the Thar has done well, Ray, AK versus AK, Bhavesh Joshi, all these films are, may not be the 100 crore type of films, but they all have very loyal fans. And uh, them, I have to say I loved Ray. Oh, you like Ray? Okay, yeah. great, great. Yeah, so there you go, you know, and uh, it's, it's about the quality for me, it's about each piece. You know, uh, but now that I think that I think Bhavesh, AK, Ray and Thar are o very uh, OTT films that have done really well. Now I'm aiming for the cinemas. So I'm doing the Abhinav Bindra biopic finally and that will be a theatrical release. So I hope people come and see and enjoy that film. But I, again, just because it's for theatres, I won't. I'm also producing it like I produced Thar. But I, so just because it's for theatres, I won't try and make it more commercial. I, I, I don't believe that that's a thing. I think you've got to make the best film possible. You've got to pay, be honest to the material and you have to respect the intelligence of the audience and I know that if we make a fantastic film again, they, they go, people will come, you know. From your dad's time till now, content has evolved so much. Yeah. But if you had to pick one of your father's film, which one would be and not from the recent one, something yeah. from his era? Mr. India is great. Uh, Shekhar Kapoor is a um, maverick filmmaker. Pukar is amazing. Rajkumar Santoshi. Nayak is uh, Shankar. Very good. Parinda, Vidhu Vinod Chopra. Uh, these are the, the, the older films that I, I like. I prefer these films, the ones that I mentioned. And, um, but then recently you have Vikram Aditya Motwani's AK vs. AK. You have Zoya Akhtar's Dil Dhadakne Do. You have Raj Singh Chaudhary's Thar. So um, the, the key to longevity is adaptability, you know, to kind of change your gears with the taste of people and, and kind of try and keep doing original work, which is done I think better than anybody else in my opinion.
Lastly, you come from a family where everybody is so stylish, whether it's Sona, Maria, your dad, yourself. But if you had to pick, who do you think is the most stylish amongst all of y'all? Mm, I don't know about most, but I think everybody, like, so I, I don't think my father is somebody that shops a lot or that seeks out things for his own wardrobe. You know, but if somebody shows something to him, he has a very specific opinion on it. But I think me and Sonam are always looking to add things to our wardrobes ourselves. You know what I mean? We're very... Rhea is obviously a stylist and all of... But in terms of her personal style, she's very... Ba like, she keeps it simple. Um, so I think me and Sonam are quite obsessed with it, I, I would say. So I, I would say probably Sonam and I. So, yeah. Thank you so much, Arsh.